In Hattiesburg, Fox 23's Quintus Jones caught up with a restaurant owner directly affected by the virus's economic impact. That's right, business owners, particularly restaurants, are really feeling the brunt of this. The purple parrot right here behind me is a popular one. Well, now it's lights out. It's 1.30 in the afternoon, and Crescent City Grill is usually bustling with business. We have 300 employees uh, through, uh, that work in all of our restaurants. Today, it's practically empty. We've seen about an 80% uh, drop. Owner Robert St. John says the drop is hitting him and his workers. There's a lot of not only employees, but a lot of families who are impacted uh, by what's going on now. And would you like a receipt for this thing? Just down the street at T-Bones Records, a similar scene. I think that's the toughest part. There's so much unknown. Both owners are watching and waiting to see if leaders in Washington will offer some relief. St. John says they need help and fast. Uh, immediate help is needed. Uh, I don't know what that's going to be. We're, we're still trying to find out. We can't afford to keep everybody staffed up. We want to find ways for them to make it through these times. But despite the circumstances, they're still open. It's just not business as usual. Supporting local business in any capacity is a good thing to do to help all of us get through this time. Now, both owners tell me while they have cut hours, no one has been laid off and they hope that doesn't change. For now, reporting in Hattiesburg, I'm Quintus Jones for Fox 23 News.